morning, this is Maria here from GoalieTrainingPro.com. Today's video, I'm gonna give you five strategies that will help you have more of the mobility, the stamina, uh, the stability, and the speed that you see in LA goaltenders, Jonathan Quick. Check him out. So mobility is where we have to start, or flexibility. And this tool, the foam roll, is one of the key ways that we can um, make a big leap in our flexibility training. Some of you I know stretch consistently and aren't seeing the results that you want. Um, so starting with the foam roll, we can break up some of those adhesions between the connective tissue called fascia and the underlying muscle. So we'll do three segments, the outer third, the middle third, and the inner third. And not, not uh, too quick, just easy. And if you find a knot in there, you can even just sit on it, put some pressure on it till it dissipates. From here, we're gonna take our foam roller. And we're gonna elevate it onto a bench. We're going to get that medial hamstring because sometimes goalies stretch the daylights out of their groins, but it's really that medial hamstring that's limiting their ability to get down into their splits. So again, from just above the knee to right up into the groin. You could also use a lacrosse ball for that one. The groins don't work in isolation. They actually work in conjunction with the abdominal muscles. So if my oblique abdominals are restricted, that can affect how I use my groin or overuse my groin and contribute to groin injuries. So we'll do our half kneeling groin stretch, but we'll add an oblique reach. And we can even bring both arms in I'm not trying to force that range, I'm just trying to use it. For this drill, using uh, what's called the leapfrog, so this is a belt around my hips, you can just do it with a regular bungee cord. And then I have another resistance cord in my hands. So when I get low, the bungees are pulling me that way. So I have to use my muscles to stabilize. I'm holding this straight out in front because that makes me have to stabilize in a rotational or against a rotational torque and then I'm just staying nice and low I'm lengthening under tension here and I'm shortening under tension here I'm practicing staying in that nice low stable position and finally if I want to work a little bit more dynamic stabilization um, we're going to do our half kneeling lateral crease push. Um, and I'm going to hold this medicine ball straight out in front of me. And it doesn't have to be heavy. This is just a four pounder. Um, it shouldn't be an arduous load, just a little bit of overload. So I'm gonna come up, but keep this straight out in front as I come across and down. So again, I don't want to be pushing to my right and have my shoulders stay behind to my left. So I'm here. Staying nice and level dynamically stabilizing with my torso. So this is Maria from GoalieTrainingPro.com where my goal is to help 10,000 goalies win more games with fewer injuries, even if you don't have the genetic gifts or natural ability of your competitors. Happy training.